and Merry Christmas Eve, my friends. Hope all you are doing well. I'm Ellen. I want to welcome all my new and returning subscribers to... Tomorrow is Christmas Day, my friends. OMG, it's finally here. Came in so quickly. Well, today's recipe, I'm going to show you how to make the best, moist, and fluffy Southern Pineapple Coconut Cake. And this is the bomb.com. It is so yummy, full of coconut and pineapple goodness. We're going to make a homemade pineapple filling to go in the middle of the cake. Mmm. And we're going to put a coconut cream cheese frosting on it. We're going to put lots of coconut on top and on the sides, too. Oh, my mouth is probably just talking about it. <laughs> and as always, it is so simple and easy to make. And if you're a fan of coconut and pineapple, y'all will fall in love with this cake. It is so heavenly. This cake would be great for any holiday, any night of the week, or family gatherings. So grab your coconut, your pineapple, and your flour sugar, because we're about to bake some coconut pineapple cake magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go. All right, my friends, the first thing we're going to do is make the pineapple filling. So in my medium saucepan, we're going to add in one 20-ounce can of crushed pineapple along with the juice. And we're going to add in two-thirds of a cup of white sugar and two tablespoons of cornstarch. Going to give that a quick stir. And we're going to let the pineapple cook for about five to eight minutes until it's thickened. All right, my friends, the pineapple is nice and thick. Mmm, don't that look good? That looks awesome. Mmm, I love the smell of pineapple. And I removed it off the fire and off the stove. So next for the final ingredient, we're going to add in one teaspoon of pineapple extract. Stir until it's nice and well and combined. All right, so now we're going to let the pineapple filling cool completely. And while this cooling, we can get started on the coconut cake. All right, my friends, in my large bowl, I have five jumbo egg whites at room temperature, and we're going to whip them until they reach nice, soft, white peaks. All right, my friends, I'm through whipping up my egg whites. They're nice, soft peaks. So now we're going to set this aside while we work on the other ingredients. All right, my friends, in my large bowl, I have one cup, which is two sticks of unsalted butter at room temperature. And we're going to add in two cups of white sugar. And we're going to cream this until it's nice and fluffy. All right, my friends, the butter and sugar is nice and creamy. So next we're going to add in one teaspoon of vanilla extract, one teaspoon of coconut extract, and one and a fourth cup of coconut evaporated milk. I just added a teaspoon of coconut extract. Mix until it's nice and well combined. All right, my friends, next we're going to slowly add three cups of sifted self-rising flour. Blend until it's nice and well incorporated. Alright my friends, I'm through mixing up everything. So next for the final ingredient, we're going to add in the egg whites that we made earlier. Going to fold this in real gently. Mmm, smells good. I love the smell of coconut. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and finish folding my egg whites and I'll bring you back. Alright my friends, I'm through Folding the egg whites into the cake batter. Nice and smooth and whipped. Alright, that looks great. Now we're ready to pour the cake batter into the pans. We're going to pour the batter into two 9 inch round cake pans that are greased with cooking spray. Alright my friends, I got my cake batter into the pan. Now we're ready to bake them. We're going to bake it in the preheated 350 degree oven and we're going to let it bake for about 23 to 30 minutes or until the toothpick in the center comes out clean. Alright, I'll see y'all back here in a minute. My friends, I smell coconut cake. I just take them out the oven. Look how nice and golden brown that looks. Mmm, smells incredible. All right, so now we're gonna let the cakes cool, and while that's cooling, we can get started on the coconut cream cheese frosting. All right, my friends, in my large bowl, I have one stick, which is a half a cup of unsalted butter at room temperature, and one eight ounce package of cream cheese, also at room temperature. 
we're gonna cream this until it's nice and fluffy. All right, my friends. Next, we're gonna add in one teaspoon of vanilla extract, one teaspoon of coconut extract, and one teaspoon of cream cheese flavor. Blend this until it's nice and well combined. All right, my friends. Next, we're gonna slowly add in one 16 ounce box of powdered sugar that I sifted. Blend this in until it's nice and well incorporated. All right, my friends. Our frosting is almost complete. There's one more ingredient we gotta add to it. One cup of sweetened shredded coconut. And just fold that in. And that's it, my friends. Our coconut cream cheese frosting is finished. And the pineapple filling is nice and cool and chill. Now we're ready to assemble the cake. All right, my friends, I got the one of the cakes on my plate. Now we're ready to ice them. So I have my pineapple filling. Gonna grab a dollop. We're gonna use half of it. And then we're gonna spread it just like that. Mmm, this looks good. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna put the other layer on top. All right, my friends, I'm through icing my cake, and I'll put the rest of the coconut on top and on the sides. And there you have it, Southern Coconut Pineapple Cake. Don't that look gorgeous? So all we do now is place the cake in the refrigerator because you want to let it get hard a little bit because this cake is very delicate. And then we'll give it a taste. All right, my friends, I fixed me up a plate. Don't that look good? And look at the pineapple filling in the middle. All right, here we go. Want to show y'all the texture. Ooh, look at that, nice and moist. Ooh, yeah, baby. Mmm. 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 Oh, this is amazing. So rich. So decadent. Mmm. That pineapple filling is amazing. And the coconut. Y'all would definitely love this cake. This deserves another bite. Oh yeah. Coconut pineapple licious. My friends, many thanks so much for watching and joining me in the kitchen today. If you enjoyed this video and this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. I do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. And I'll see y'all on my next video. Let's eat. And I want to wish all of you a very Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. Much love.